think that there are some things that we can do really well in a local authority level, you know, provide support to people who are addicted to alcohol, for example. But there are other things that we can only do well if we work together at a much bigger scale. And I'm thinking particularly about raising awareness with our communities. There is no point in me doing a campaign in Gateshead, for example, and then there being a campaign in a very similar way in Newcastle or a very similar way in Northumberland. So actually where we really benefit is by collaborating together. Um, it means that we can all you know, put all of our resources into one place and actually we can have much greater impact by doing that together. So I think that's a really important first point. The second point is, is that Balance are able to act as an independent voice. They're able to advocate at a national level um, in terms of the things that we need to happen, you know, with government through, you know, price promotion in place. And I think without having Balance, we wouldn't have that voice at that, that national scale. And we know learning as well, because obviously Balance sits alongside our tobacco control office. Um, is that actually we've got lots of learning from the last two decades on tobacco in understanding what we need to do differently. So really, you know, Balance provides a whole range of of services and offers and um, advocacy that we wouldn't be able to do if we were doing this at at an individual level. And actually, alcohol action needs to be at scale. I mean, ideally, it needs to be at national level. Um, But with the absence of a national strategy, at least we have something focused for our northeast population where we know that there's significant levels of harm.